Hey, it's Dr. Brad, and we've heard the exciting news that Equatorial Launch Australia, working with and having the permission of the traditional owners, the Yongu people, will be launching three NASA-sounding rockets from the Northern Territory. Now, this is super exciting for everyone, including me, because I will be there. Yes, I will be there for the very first launch on the 26th of June. Now, what does this mean for you? I'll be giving you behind the scenes photos, videos, and hosting a live stream of the very first launch on the 26th of June. And just a secret between you and I, I've actually never seen a rocket launch in person, so I'm super excited, uh, quite literally over the moon almost, in being able to see this. Now, why is this all happening? Well, Equatorial Launch Australia set up this spaceport uh, in this beautiful land to say, hey, up here, we're very close to the equator. Rockets like to go near the equator. That's the fastest point on Earth the Earth is spinning. We also want to be in the southern hemisphere so that you can see things in the southern space or the southern skies. And that's why NASA is here. The experiments they'll be launching want to look at objects in the southern skies, such as the Alpha Centauri system, those, that bright star, the pointer star near the Southern Cross. And they have lots of land that could be safely operated and making sure that no problems happen. And more importantly, the weather's really good up there. We often hear of weather delays in Florida. That's because Florida's a swamp. Up there, you can get the dry season, which means it's very predictable, easy to launch, and no delays. So it's going to be a super exciting time. To, so make sure to like and subscribe on YouTube to check out all the action.